Hi, I'm Angelique Roche, and this is Marvel's Voices, and I'm here with an amazing performer and now Marvel comic book writer, James Monroe Iglehart. Thank you very much, Angelique. I am so excited to be here. When did you get into comic books? I got into comics around that time when, when the most popular comic in the world was Wolverine. Oh, Logan. Who is he? What does he do? How come, what is it, is it Weapon X or is it Weapon 10? I mean, what, what is in his head? <laughs> What's going on? How come nobody knows? How come Scott's letting him so close to Gene and not slapping the living hell out of him? What's I, going on? I you have a lot mean? of feels about Gene. I'm like, really, Scott? You I have, don't actually, you know, let me tell you, happening, actually, let me tell you something right now. I have feelings about Scott, not Gene. I got feelings about Scott Summers. You are the leader of one of the baddest superhero teams arguably ever created in the world handed to you by one of the most powerful mutants on earth and all you can do is complain your your squad is so deep angel beast Iceman, Marvel Girl, Storm, Jubilee, you've got everybody and you're worried because your girl is looking at the short dude you can blast people with your eyes so what he can heal he'll be out for a good 10 hours y'all can get on the blackbird and fly away before the brother can catch you but no you went gene i think we should discuss we ain't discussing nothing we've been together for 20 years girl get you behind in the car let's go <laughs> what are you doing <laughs> you gonna get it you gonna give a little short partner a chance to talk no nah, no nah, man look you are tall dark and handsome and you can blast people with your eyes and then when I when I finally got to like the the last Phoenix story where he became the Phoenix and killed everybody, I was so mad. I was like, "Really, Scott? We're we're, we're still dealing with this, huh? Thirty years, still uh, still still a little got a little chip on your shoulder, Scott. Still a little upset. <laughs> still a little still a little mad. Gene's not even here, and you're still you you with you with Emma Frost, another fine woman who wears almost nothing, and you're still still pissed off, huh, Scott? What do you want, Scott? We don't know. No one knows what Scott wants. I have deep feelings about Scott Summers. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Thanks so much for being with me, James. Oh, thank you very much. Please, I had a great time. <laughs> and you make sure that you go and check out Marvel Comics Presents number three out right now in your local comic book store or online. Yeah. That's where I read mine.